Hello. This video gives an overview of the new features contained within the 544 update of Axis Camera Station. The first addition is the ability to add a QR code as a credential to a card holder within the inbuilt Axis Control software. The QR code can be emailed to a recipient, which then enables access to a device that has the barcode reader ACAP installed upon it, such as Adore Intercom. This is a cost-effective and efficient way of granting temporary access to a site. Please take a look at the manual, which highlights how to configure this. The next improvement is to data search. In recent releases, we have added AND and OR to the search filter and also preset time filters. We now have the ability to monitor data live. This data could be access control data or license plates generated from the access license plate verifier ACAP. This could also be used by data injected into ACS via the API, such as a point of sale integration. And note, you can also apply a filter to the live data, such as refund or void. Here you can see live access control information presented on the screen with the live video. The next improvement is to an existing function, and it is the ability to increase the instant replay playback duration. And this allows you to instantly replay video while in the live workspace. You can also combine this and see other live cameras and replay the video from the chosen camera at the same time. This is a really useful feature for instant verification. The final element that has been changed is that we can now create action rules to display cameras in a hotspot. In this example, I've created three action rules. When there is motion in a camera, it is then presented in a view containing a hotspot. Note that you could also display views of an area in the hotspot, and you can also create more complex scenarios containing multiple hotspots. If we take a look at the setup in action, as we see the person moving through the scene, the video is displayed within the hotspot. This is ideal for out-of-hours monitoring of secure areas or for perimeters. I hope this video has been interesting. Thank you for watching.